think of a race going on. We are going straight. Yep, no oh, safety yeah. car. Oh, yeah. Uh, where we go as Danza is actually getting a great start. Uh, Jamie didn't actually get Ooh, one, but off. we see the top two, yeah. As Tetris gone. Top two actually kind of caught us nothing here because I didn't expect... <laughs> I didn't expect no big uh, formation up, but we saved it. Uh, we are definitely green flag conditions right now, and we're looking at a bit of a run. I think they're between yeah, Mr. Coke and Nick. Remember, they are both in, from England, so don't take each other out, boys. The Queen is watching. <laughs> the Queen is watching. As, uh, as the Yami try to take it to Danza right now. And it wasn't as clean. Really penalties as well. I think we'll go back to Nick because Nick's put a bit of pressure on Colin. I'm not quite sure which battle. I'm going to switch between both of those, so I'm going to have to go back to Yami. And uh, Ryan actually loses it into sector, uh, sector 2 is exactly what I've said on the start of the stream. You don't want to touch the Kerbs because they can actually... I don't think Verkin's going to be able to defend too much of this. Verkin's actually might be under attack from Nick as well. You can see this, don't you? A 2 for 1 special. It could very well be as long as you can last the late breakers Ooh. up into turn 3. Contact mid. There Ooh. is definitely contact and there's a car going around and that will definitely be Verkin's going around. Caught him off completely in that pit stop. And there, here we go. Battle for lead. As Yami finally gets past Danza, he does. He gets the job done. While all the others kind of squamage in the race. So. And not as yep. good as... Here we go. He's run up to turn. And Jamie actually lifted him. Uh, so he doesn't want to predict that. So close to making contact, but they kept it clean. Danza will actually put the DRS into the second straight. And he actually makes the move stick. And keep his first uh, He's gonna get rid of that penalty on top of it, so it's gonna be a pretty long pit stop for the British driver, but it ain't over yet until that check it flag as we're about halfway and through Dance this is race. Going in, and Jamie's following him, so. And narrowly, I can, I can say it's a very early pit stop for them. And you can see that Lars actually gained the position from Nick because Nick served his five second penalty and he's clear four seconds. So. As of right now... And Dan's are going for it, but there are other drivers on the track. I might have to go back to them because they are making another overtake in clearly what would be into turn one. There's usually not a massive overtaking area place there or somebody yeah, runs wide. But... What happened between... Uh, he didn't and he missed the position, but he will actually gain, keep it, uh, get it back. Maybe he hit the DRS side by side again, almost making contact. But still clean the racing. What a race these guys are giving. So the, the uh, Ollie is in a bit of trouble. I'm not sure if Ollie's from the United Kingdom, or whatever. I don't see anything next to his name, but he's definitely struggling, dropping yeah, places. I think he's uh, representing the UK. With all that happened, Lars is actually got promoted to P3, and he's uh, actually kind of clear from P1 from the two people in front. And Driving, guys. Oh, there's a spin, and there's Denzel going. Oh, did he save it? Oh. No, he doesn't. He's out. He's out. Around the he's final out. corner now. No, he won't actually. Lars will get out ahead, so Lars is seizing this opportunity. Look at that, get right out ahead of Yami, out of the pit stops. <laughs> now, Yami's gonna have the fresh boots. We know it has the pace, but Lars, he's taking advantage of his fresh boots, really, as quickly as possible. Further back, I think Nick was taking an advantage. We'll keep an eye on this. I'm mean, kind of expecting any minute now he's really gonna get past. I don't think Lars gonna be too much of a fight. Yeah, he will be defensive. He actually is fighting for that pin himself off because he's got Ryan further down the road there, but they're still going for it here on the outside. Climbing the way up, there's going to be a definite battle, isn't it? Up into as Nick has got past up last, but we'll keep an eye on this battle currently at the moment. He's happy out. I must have just oh, passed it. Both the Norway Ooh. drivers lost it on the same corner. Oh no! So very unfortunate by them. Both and in the top ten and both out. This race, but unfortunate by him as Oli loses it and he will go straight into the wall, losing it. He's from big. So I'm thinking about not spectating anyone <laughs> right now because anyone I spectated the speed. Oh no, Lars's chance of getting a potential podium is gone. He had no penalties. He's uh, he's really in trouble right now. He's 14 seconds down the road there from the Norwegian. Norwegian still may be able to get through this one right now, but is there enough time? 104.7 fastest lap. Nobody even got into the 104s at all. So, not even what Danza. What a race. What a race. It's a very entertaining race. Again. Mm, so, congratulations, yeah. my friend. You know, get to see a Belgium driver.